Lowry Branch with newly drafted offensive tackle Jake Matthews. Jake, welcome to Atlanta. Yeah, thank you. I'm real excited to be here. Can't can't really express that. It's really been a whirlwind of a process. I'm happy to be here though. Yeah, I was gonna ask you, just kinda take me through your your feelings right now and, and your emotions. Um, really just a lot of excitement. I can't keep reiterating how much, you know, excitement there is right now. Um, this whole process, you know, it's really, um, looking back on it, there's so much hype and everything that goes into it. And now to finally know, uh, I know where I'm going to be and where I'm going to be playing that, you know, it takes a lot of pressure off me. I'm excited to just get in and start working. That's my, my main goal right now. Take me through Thursday night, um, while you were at the draft and just sitting there and waiting and, and waiting to hear your name being called and then finally knowing you were coming to Atlanta. Uh, it wasn't too bad, you know. Uh, thankfully, I didn't have to wait that long. Mm -hmm. Six overall is pretty good for me. I'm happy with that. Um, and also, I was real happy that Atlanta picked me. I could just tell throughout the whole process whenever I visited them here, um, just felt really good connection with, you know, uh, Co Coach Smith and Coach Tice and everyone here in the organization really felt like I'd fit in well and uh, also could be someone that could contribute from the from the get-go. So I'm ready to get in and start contributing. And talk about your cufflinks. You wore a Falcon. Yeah, I you, did. You knew, right? I had a really good feeling. I, my hopes were high for Atlanta, and I'm, I'm real glad it worked out that way. So a little, little lucky token I had wearing for the whole deal. And you talked about you were picked sixth overall. You got some bragging rights with the family yeah. because you come from um, a deep-rooted NFL lineage with your family. Um, I know it's it's something that a lot of people have talked about, but something that you pointed out was that you want to make your own legacy. You know, you want to kind of make a name for yourself. Right. No, it is definitely hard to kind of get away from that whole mm -hmm. Matthews thing. Uh, there's there's going to be comparisons all the time. I've had it my entire career, comparisons with my dad and mm -hmm. cousins and uncle and brother. Um, you know, I, I can't keep saying how much, you know, I'm going to go in, I'm going to try to be my own man. I'm going to, from the very first day, uh, you know, give this organization, this team, everything I have, whether it's in the weight room, the film room, or on the practice field, or, you know, at game time, I'm going to go out there and uh, leave it all out in the field. And um, I can't stress how, you know, thankful I am for this team for, you know, putting their faith in me and trusting me with this pick. And, you know, my entire career is going to be to try to prove that, you know, this was a mistake. Uh, I'm the I'm the guy that's going to be here for the next few years. Definitely. Talk about um, just how you feel knowing that you're going to be protecting for guys like Roddy White, Steven Jackson in the backfield, and um, for Matt Ryan, who threw over 4,000 yards last season. No, that there's definitely a lot of talent here, and that's one of the reasons I was real – uh, attracted this place is you know this is a team that has a really good chance of you know going to the Super Bowl uh, this year I, I'm excited to be a part of it I think it was a steal for them to be up that high and for me to have the opportunity to get picked this high and go to such a great team like Atlanta I, I just feel real honored to be a part of it and I'm ready to get to work um, GM Thomas Dimitrov talked about how this team has got to be bigger and stronger and tougher. Can you kind of talk about how your toughness can, can really contribute? Yeah, I think that's one of the reasons they picked me. I, I think um, all throughout college I put on film that I'm a guy that you know is big and strong and knows how to play the game and uh, understands what it takes to play the uh, offensive line. And um, that's what I'm going to continue doing is coming in and uh, you know doing things the right way, working hard and getting after it. And I think if I keep having that mindset, everything's going to work out. You came from an offense um, with Johnny Manziel as the quarterback who ran the ball a lot. Can you kind of talk about how you go from that type of an offense to what the Falcons run? Yeah, hopefully it's a lot easier. I think my last quarterback, Johnny, ran around a little bit, and um, uh, that's definitely a lot harder to do in the NFL. And Matt Ryan does a great job of getting rid of the ball and uh, you know getting it to the playmakers. And you know, I'm really excited to play with him. I actually got a chance to text him a little bit last night, and you know that was really cool to be able to talk to him and kind of start that relationship. But I, I am really looking forward to you know blocking for him. I think he's a great quarterback, and hopefully have a few good years together. How cool was that to see? I saw tweets from Matt Ryan and Steven Jackson once you got picked. How cool was that? That's awesome. I, it's it. I feel really honored, especially coming from such great players. You know. Hopefully one day I can kind of be up in those rankings. That would be my goal, but uh, you just got to take it one day at a time. Well, everyone is so excited to have you here. We appreciate your time, and Thank welcome you. to Atlanta. Thank you. I really appreciate it.